I'm already loving the sound. The audio's already fucking making my head spin. Oh, dude, this guy's insane in the membrane right now. This this guy was a, a, a shock trooper who went off in a, in a red starfare and literally killed all these pirates, these nine tails, on the first episode. And, and now he's hunting them down. Now he's going I after killed them. killed them all. Goddamn right you did. Fuck them. And killed their friends. Yes. Their leaders. Yes. But it was like pulling out weeds. They just keep coming, don't they? Rip one out. Yeah. Another one grows in its place. Fuck, I'm feeling it. I got the chills already. It Hooked didn't me really in. Matter anyway. I'm she sorry. Was gone. Oh my god. The pain remained. Oh Jesus. This is so good. This is so good. You Sometimes motherfuckers. The old people will still say to me. Mary wouldn't want you to be like this. Oh my god, this is so you good. Find yourself someone new. Listen to me. I'm turning this motherfucking shit up. This is already so good. Okay? The setup is amazing. Everybody loves Someone a revenge special. film. Everybody. They don't understand. I already found her. Even her humble beginnings were somewhat special. Audio. Born in the airlock of one of the r, &R space stations floating around out there in the meteor bands. Abandoned by her father before she could even qualify as a human. Abandoned by her mother in that very airlock about three minutes after being born. Picked up by a Banu merchantman in need of spare parts and the means to buy them. He sold her to a slave trader on Hurston. Oh, Mary. Oh, God damn it, Mary. She's I gone. Know, right? She's gone. She's gone now, dude. Fuck. Oh, damn. She had a hard beginning, too. And that's where I first met her. Oh, shit. Are we going prequel mode? We're going back in time when he met her? Shit. Beautiful. Beautiful. Pacing is... Superb. Oh shit. He was contracted to kill the woman he loved, but before he even knew her. That is fucking amazing. That is awesome. Audio enhancement. Welcome, Mr. Amaro. I'm Carla. Manny's chemical expertise. Is she using a pseudo name? Cause I thought I thought this was uh <laughs> Where's Manny? He got held up, so he sent me in his stead. Just you, huh? You know. It can be quite dangerous for a little girl like you to be out here all alone. You're not scared. Uh Good day, Mr. Amaro. I hope you don't mind us doing business this way. As I'm sure my assistant has already told you. I love the ring, right? Voice today. <laughs> retro, very I don't retro. I like it when things change last minute, Manny. You should know <laughs> this. I assure you, it was unavoidable. Fine. I go. All clear. Bring it in. I like the kind of British, you know, that, that British blonde bad guy kind of vibe going on right there. Good shots. Dude, if I was in like, you know, the future 
you know, and I was in the 30th century, I'd totally be rocking an old fucking Nokia tone on my Moby glass. I'm just saying. <laughs> Ash says it's true. We make the best villains. <laughs> Yeah, Peru says you it's Americans love idea. having English as the bad guys. Right. It's how we. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> <laughs> it's how we started out. You know what I'm saying? It's very easy for us to put you guys as the bad guys. It's 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 how you know we started out. No, it's just the way it's. <laughs> Welcome to the fam, evil teddy bear. Not so fast. I had a lot of extra expenses getting these boxes here. I'm afraid the price has gone up 15%. Oh, don't do not do that. That's shysty. Shit, look at those eyes. She's like, what? 15%? <laughs> no problem. In fact, to sweeten the deal and further strengthen our future cooperation together, I'll throw in a case of Hurston's finest. How about that? I'll also have Carla deliver it to your place, personally. Funds received. Sure. I could do with a little celebration tonight. Great. Carla? Yes, Manny? I trust you'll take good care of Mr. Amaro. Against the firepower of the arrow, there wasn't much I could do. I had no choice but to follow them back to Mr. Amaro's hideout. I this had the footage wonderful. I needed. Now I just needed to stomp the roach. Damn. I remember thinking the girl could be a complication. I'd have to try to keep her out of it. Oh, so he's just there for the deal. The he's not there for the girl. The put on the shuttle did its job well. Amaro's preferred hideout was an old abandoned mine, just half a click northeast of Lauraville. The storytelling's fantastic. All was quiet when I arrived. I can't believe this only has 300 views, dudes. Ridiculously crazy. I mean, the amount of editing here is just phenomenal. I love the fucking music he puts in. Dead. Single round of the head. Somebody beat me to it. The hover bike at the entrance must belong to the other assailant. By the way, hover, hover bike song now out on DG360. A proper Hurston bloodbath. The action was still hot. I needed to get in on it before it was all over. Shit, shit is going down. Ooh, shit. Damn. Oh, love it. Love I'm what he's doing. God damn, look at I the fucking editing on this. My patience. Person What's up, shit, Cuckoo? Advocacy. Drop your weapons. <laughs> Drop your weapon and come on out with your hands up. Do it now. Okay, you go, Chief. So fucking good. Gotta hand it to you. You got some balls taken on the. I knew it. Duke Nukem. That's the fucking voice. I kept thinking to myself, where have I heard this voice before? But when he said balls, I thought, you've got balls of steel. Like, that is exactly what it. That is great. This motherfucker's Duke Nukem. He, this isn't Doom. This is Duke motherfucking Nukem right here. Lorville Mafia like this, all by yourself. What made you do it? Was it the 15%? Hmm. Actually, I'm just a drone. You should ask her. Oh, shit. That's how he met the love of his life. The love of his life shot him to begin with. What is going on? Sorry about your prize bounty hunter. Who, who are you? Just the, 
daughter of hers then. Who hired you? <laughs> Amaro did. In a way. But now we must go. Better luck next time. Give it to him. <laughs> Purr. God damn. Now that's how you meet the love of your life right there. <laughs> that's how you do it. Every day is a struggle. Every day is a trial. Every day is a failure. I have to walk another mile. Is this guy fucking... Wait, wait, wait. Is this guy literally making his own song up to his fucking machinima? Is this guy literally... Because I've never heard that song before. And I'm telling you something. This motherfucker is making his own song up to his goddamn machinima. Let me just say again. Shame. That this only has 341 views. Let me just tell you. This is why DG360 is around here. Literally want you guys to go to the channel right now. Subscribe and like this video. Everybody who's watching this. Go over there. Flood his channel with DG360 goodness. Give him the love that he deserves. He's literally making his own song up. And it's decent. Fucking A. Wherever you go. So good. So good. As you make the bed. That's good. So you must lie. This is good. <laughs> the sun hurt. Everything hurt. I should have seen it coming. Running her face through the archives brought up a whole string of misunderstandings, misbehaviors. No wonder he went off in rage on the first episode. No wonder. Persons. Nothing. God damn, I got chills stuck. right now. I literally have chills it right now. She worked her way up, all the way to the top of the food chain, all while evading prosecution. She was something else. There was no time to pity myself anymore. Now, I had purpose. A bounty to be caught instead of killed. I knew this was gonna be and good. her name was Carla Slain. No one knows. I, I don't know. Listen, listen. Where the life force. Because, like, in the first episode, Mary died. So I thought he was going back in time and meeting Mary. So now I'm com I'm kind of fucking confused as what's going on here. I don't know if I'm in the present or if I'm in the fucking past. But I'm telling you what. I know I'm going to rewatch this shit again. That's how good this is. To make sure I'm, I'm fucking following here. But, like, Carla Slane might be the, the pseudonym for uh, Mary. Uh, that that is the the his love that died in the first episode, uh, that he just like completely goes off and and uh, I'm telling you what, wow, wow, what do you guys think? No one knows where the next wind blows. This is so good. Listen to this man. Is that I'll follow you. Oh, dude, dude. 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 You make the bed. Dude. Why? Why? So you must lie. Wow. Wow. That's a gem. That's a diamond in the rough right here. That's why DG360 is around here to give you guys the fucking diamonds in the rough. Let me tell you something, guys. I would like that a thousand motherfucking times if I could. Uh, outstanding work. I can't wait for the next episode. Masterfully done, says our very own Limitless Factor who's here. And I think Limitless was the guy who, put it, who, who uh, posted it in our Discord. And that is why we do what we do. Thank you, Limitless. I believe it was you. Sorry if it was not and it was somebody else, but I believe it was Limitless that posted the uh, second. Elite Expeditionary is in there. 
Elite Expeditionary, a wonderful Star Citizen Machinima uh, producer. Uh, not enough comments. And there's Sketch, uh, one of our members as well. Sketch is in there. Uh, but like I, I'm telling you guys, that is just that's that's fucking fantastic, and we're gonna we're gonna give them a lot of love. We're gonna give them a lot of love. Oh, are we gonna refresh the comments? Okay, thank you, mod eighty one. Are you guys going in there right now? You guys going in there right now? Let's see. What do we got? There's mod eighty one. Great machinima. There we go. Nice, nice, nice. Thank you. DG three sixty sent me. There we go. Yep, Michael's in there. Thank you. Yeah, you guys let them know DG360 sent you. And then I'm going to post this uh, first thing tomorrow. I'm going to post this on the channel first thing tomorrow. Did you add one of your own? Let's see what Ender did. Let's see what Ender did in here. This is great. You guys are giving love on stream live here with me. That's awesome. Thank you very much. Uh, let's see. Where's Ender at? I don't see Ender's in there. Where the fuck is Ender's? <laughs> You guys are awesome. Fur Lover says, yes, that was me. Okay, cool, cool. Uh, the name of it is um, Cut and Win Ink. And I'm going to, I'm actually going to copy this and put the, um, pa I'm going to paste it. What's up, Kev? How you doing here? Kev from Uncle Yo! Funk Machinima. <laughs> Nothing's impossible. Fucking love you guys. And we're sending love over to Cut and Win right now. Um, let's see if we got any additional comments. Uh, we're, we're live and we're, we're heading on over there. Uh, make sure you're liking it as well. Let's see here. Sort by newest first. Absolutely brilliant stuff. DG fam around. A masterpiece of storytelling, says Techno. Ender says amazing work, raising the bar. Absolutely. There's Mod81. There's Michael. Listen, you guys are fantastic. Thank you for helping out. And then when this releases to YouTube, uh, he'll have an additional flood of people. And let's keep track of this and let's see what we do and let's see if we affect this channel. Guy deserves more subscribers. And, you know, like when somebody makes something like this, right? I can tell you, did you add one too? Thank you, Ash. When somebody makes something like this, okay, when a content creator takes their time to make something of this quality at this level, and then you only get 340 views, you're just, the fucking wind is puffed out of your sails and you decide, eh, I'm not going to fucking do anymore because it only got 300 views. This is why we're around here. This is why DG360 is around, to put the wind back in the sails, to tell these th wonderful creators, don't fucking worry about it. Keep being passionate and do what it is that you like to do, that you want to do, and don't be discouraged so we can see more amazing content. Because if we weren't around and we didn't do this, trust me, a lot of people wouldn't take the effort to go through another one because it takes days, weeks, months of time to do these things. And so, you know, because of this fucked up, fucked up YouTube algorithm, let me tell you what, Listen to what happened to me. Go. Uh, I'm going to show you what happened to me. And this is how fucked up the YouTube algorithm is. Okay? It, it absolutely had to take a long time. Sorry about that. Congratulations, the first 25. God damn myself. Ah, I'm annoying myself. No wonder it's so hard to grow. No, <laughs> no. So listen. I post a video almost every day, right? It's been very difficult lately because of everything going on. And, and I got to go up to Cleveland today. And Christy's got some scans up in uh, Cleveland. But anyway... I haven't posted a couple videos in the past couple of days. And as you guys know, we were on a nice roll, 4,000 views, uh, 1,000 views, 5,000 views, 3,000 views, two, two, three. So we were getting thousands of views. Now I didn't post for about four days. Look what happens to the YouTube algorithm when you don't post every fucking day. Now look at this drop off. Look, we go down to 200 views, 100 views, 700 views. So if you don't post a video every single day and feed the fucking YouTube algorithm machine that, that is just there to churn advertisements and, and monetization and all the corporate fucking bullshit, this is how difficult it is to be on YouTube, to be a content creator, because all the people flooding uh, YouTube and, and being on this platform and putting content on here, if you do not do it every single day, the YouTube algorithm will literally take a giant dump on you. I have 14,000 subscribers now. Thank you very, very much. We're growing. We're doing wonderful. Hardcore committed fans here on DG360. 
But I even suffer from this shit with 14,000 subscribers and getting on average about two to 3,000 views a day. When I don't post a video for more than one, two or three days, what happens is I have a huge fucking drop off in my search. I have a huge drop off in my views because the algorithm says, you know, the algorithm goes like this. Oh, done. Nothing left. Just gas. Okay. All right. Fuck you then, dude. And then it doesn't. It, it just pushes me over. It's like it pushes me over. And it literally takes about a week or two to, to pump back out. So if you're somebody who's a content creator, for instance, like cut and win, like where, where we were watching, right? And you're, you're gone for a while because you're making great shit. What ends up happening is, is that when you come back, right, you get pooped on by the algorithm. So here's a guy, and this is why a lot of people just end up saying fuck it and they don't and they don't continue with YouTube. And I don't blame them, is because they put in, you know, months and months and months and months of work to do this. And then what happens is, is nobody gets to see it because the YouTube algorithm is so fucked. Because it's too busy putting Pootie Pie content out. Or or whatever the fuck, you know? Jack Septic guy or whatever the fuck. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know. Let, let's promote the people with a bajillion, you know, motherfuckers and let's make as much money as we can and shit on everybody else, right? It's ridiculous. And that's what DG360 is. DG360 is a conduit in which people can find great shit that deserves much more views and bypasses the fucking YouTube algorithm. That is what DG360 is. Like, I've decided that we have become a fucking voice for people that need help, that gr create great stuff that can't be seen because YouTube is just turning to churn out, you know, the most popular of popular fucking shit. That's why when you type in Star Citizen, all the fuck you ever see is board gamer, noobifier, morphologist, and then, you know, a couple up and comers. You know, because they've they've perfected the SEO. They've put out videos every fucking day. So the algorithm's like, ooh, ooh. Now, Explodos, very um, emotional today. So I'm going to read <laughs> what, he's, what he's writing to me. Explodos says, I bypass the algorithm. Uh, you can bypass it by searching Star Citizen every day and telling it you only want videos posted today. Mm hmm. That way, every day you see SC videos, the algorithm ignored. Well, that is great. So use your filters is what Explodo is saying. Shikuku. And, you know, the sad thing is a lot of people don't like a lot of people just don't do that. What Explodo does. Thank you, Explodo, for doing that. Shikuku says you can also click the Star Citizen meta tag on the top of the YouTube window. And that only gives you Star Citizen related content. Aha. Uh -huh. Yes. Um, so Explodo and Shikuku are filter warriors. They're, they're people who have upgraded their search game. And they're a small percentage of people. Uh, <laughs> uh, but hopefully more people do what Explodo and Shikuku do. But I don't expect they will. Uh, tech says, it seems most people are passive YouTube consumers. You're on it, Tech. You always are, buddy. Thank you. Thank you, Killian. The quality and stamina. <laughs> yeah. I love that he's got the, he has figured out how to make the robot voice, the AI robot voice. To make her, you know, our verbology, quality, stamina, like this, like Killian has cracked the, the code as it were. He makes the bot speak in DG speak. That is brilliant. That is brilliant, Killian. That is great. That is just absolutely just, that is a, that is a brilliant thing you just did, dude. Like brilliant. I usually search Twitch streams by viewer count lowest, says Per. Interesting. Oh, yes, your Google Foo is strong. Yes, Shikuku. Shikuku is very knowledgeable. Shikuku's, like, his IQ, he's got to be up there with Einstein. I mean, we're talking, like, 130, 140, somewhere thereabouts. I mean, Shikuku's got, like, top-notch IQ. No, I can't even get close to his IQ. I'm just saying. 
Um, let's see here. Uh, you are helping this time explode. Oh, thank you so much. And and again, thank you, Killian. Let's get back to the show. And please, guys, please, 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 you know, cut and win. And DG360, we, we all need help. <laughs> we, let's just, YouTube, let's just face it. <laughs> YouTube is a, is a beast. We all need the help. 